In the first script we wrote in notepad this hello world.ahk file. We wrote a script which opened notepad and sent the text hello world to it. So if we run that by double clicking it, it prints out the text hello world. But in the actual file, we open the file to edit it with notepad. You can see that we've got the run command and that's a fairly common command so you could easily discover that using the AHK, AHK documentation. But notepad.exe is the application it opens. How would you know what the keyword is to open your perhaps obscure application that you're using in order to instruct that to do certain commands that you would like to automate. So to find those keywords to use in our script, we use a program called windowspy.ahk. So if we open a file explorer and look in the folder which auto hotkey was actually installed in and it's usually in C program files auto hotkey you'll see a file called windowspy.ahk if you double click on that it'll bring up this GUI graphical user interface that was written in auto hotkey that shows you all sorts of useful information that we can use to write scripts now in this section there's information letting you know how to target a particular application and in this section it tells you mouse position which is useful when you're writing a script and you want the mouse to target a particular location on your screen and click on it so mostly it's these two sections that you'll be using when you hover over or click on sorry a particular application you'll see the information in the window spy change so it tells you here that because I clicked on the file explorer that that process is called explorer.exe and it's got all the properties of that window so window tile class and process which will be used mostly now for our notepad if you look now you'll see that the process is called notepad.exe and that corresponds to what we use in the script notepad.exe 